Hey there, friends, family, and loved ones all. I want to bring your attention to anybody that has a teenager or a youth that is uh, going to dentists because they promote fluoride for one thing. We all know it calcifies the pineal gland, which is your higher consciousness, but most people don't know removing your wisdom teeth does the same thing. It's all connected through these nerves, the avalar nerves that go up into the brain and to the pineal gland. This is all by design. And just think about wisdom. Why are they removing your wisdom teeth? Why are they called your wisdom teeth? So this website, Green Medical Info, is a very good site. Thank you, Lynn, for sending it to me. Five million people have their teeth removed, wisdom teeth removed, more than half, completely unnecessary. Prudent decision-making with adherence to specified indicators for removal may reduce the number of surgical procedures by 60%. Many oral health experts recommend extracting wisdom teeth only if they're growing in a non-angle, causing pain, or affected by tooth decay. Extracting wisdom teeth is not a risk-free procedure. Opiate addiction is another risk as most oral surgeons prescribe opiates for post-surgical pain. Root canals is another risky procedure that is largely driven by profit motives. Root canal-treated teeth often end up harboring harmful microbes, the toxic waste products. And it goes on. This is a very good article that why it's about a money maker. It's about making money. It's about keeping you sick, keeping you in ill health. Dentists never heal. Doctors never heal. They only treat the uh, issues, never the symptoms. And then they remove out your root canals, which is all connected to your body. Um, and you can see all the nerves that are connected to the teeth and connected. See the sensory root, the motor root maxillary nerve, you know, TMJ with your jaw getting locked, that's stress. Dentists do not do anything to treat anything to do with emotional issues causing physical, is physical issues. Neither do the medicine doctors as well. But look at all the nerves, the mental nerve, the nerve, nerve, nerve that can get infected and get impacted and get cut and affect you throughout your body. So wisdom teeth grow in sideways and straighten out over time. The pain is delivered to rewire your brain and open new pathways. You're truly, your God truly was an intelligent creator. Do you think, you think God created the intelligence that to, to make wisdom teeth so bad that they had to pull out your wisdom teeth because God's intelligent design didn't design you right? Give me a break. Uh, the train is deliberate to rewire your brain, open new pathways. The adrenaline from the pain was a hidden gift. These four wisdom teeth are also wired directly to your heart and your pineal gland. They're called wisdom teeth for a reason, and this is why they're eager to pull them to rob you of your power and your true potential. So here's another thing to do with root canals and breast cancer, the lymph connection, your lymphatic nodes. Look at it going through the jaws, through the mouth, all the way down to the breasts here. 80% of women that have root canal surgery get breast cancer. That and with the wire bras that push it up, they block the nodes of the lymph lymph nodes to keep you from proper circulation causing cancer i mean this is this is not discussed or known by many people several different articles showing you the link between missing teeth and breast cancer and again um why are you removing your molars you know again surgery affecting your root canals which are all connected to all parts of your body and when i do my biomag healing I scan teeth and I connect it down to the different organs that are being affected by the root canal surgeries. So when you do surgery on the teeth, you're sometimes possibly look at the nerves behind the teeth and everything. You're, it's going through your whole body and goes down to the uh, next level of your body. And I use these uh, teeth mouth charts with my biomag healing uh, to determine what the causes are. And then I'll follow the nerves down to the different organs and find out what organs are being affected by the injuries caused from the molar damage to the nerves or the wisdom damage as well. And here's a very good chart to show the different parts of the mouth. And if you start from the inside, let's say you've got the um, uh, uh, molars back here and you get the nicked nerve you have energy issues, budget issues, headaches, migraines, epilepsy, dizziness, blood, spinal cord, brain, ear, elbow, all affected shoulder and nerves, and it affects your heart and your small intestines. Just from that one tooth alone. Same thing on the other side. How many dentists are going to tell you about this? Not many. So this is something you can understand why 
taking out your teeth. I mean, these dentists are not there to help you. They're giving you fluoride. They're giving you taking out, remove, cut, surgery, never preventative. Don't eat healthy food. No, protect your gums. No, don't, you know, floss. That's all they can tell you is to floss, you know, and use, use, uh, use um, uh, fluoride uh, toothpaste, you know, and things like that. I mean, it's just, it's just amazing. There's green dentistries now. Um, you can look up green dentistries that have gone through the whole system to take out a lot of the toxicity, which I highly recommend. And I highly recommend this book, Whole Body Dentistry by Dr. Mark Briner. Uh, I took the biomag class at Dr. Garcia's with Mr. Briner, Dr. Briner, and his son is also doing it as well. Uh, he gets into the health of the body, fillings, root canals, cavitations, periodontal disease, headaches, facial pain, crowns, bridges, and fluoride. So if you want to bone up, get more information. But please, please, please educate yourself, all you with children and teenagers. Please educate them because the pressure for them to get, um, it's happening to my son, being getting pressured to get his, uh, his wisdom teeth removed, though he's in no pain and, and, and whatnot. So, oh, preventative, preventative, but all the issues it causes. And again, know the risks, know the complications, know the issues, know the side effects before you do that. But what to know before wisdom teeth abstraction? You can get dislodged blood clots, high temperature, uh, discharge in the extraction site, persistent pain and swelling, persistent heavy bleeding that does not subside, throbbing pain in the gum or jaw, unpleasant smell in the mouth. All of these are, are caused by wisdom teeth extractions that aren't even necessary. Um, and in closing here, I'll put in the notes this TikTok page uh, about wisdom teeth being connected to your pineal gland as more and more people are waking up and understanding that it's not necessary, it doesn't need to be done, and can be harmful to your higher consciousness. And just to drive home how important your wisdom teeth are and your pineal gland, the secret of Santa Claus. Why does he come down the chimney? chimney? The word claws, claustrum, represents the precious gift, the holy oil, Christos, Christ, that is secreted in the brain. Symbolically, the spine is the chimney, that the holy oil travels up the Christos, Christ, and pineal gland, the single eye, the lamp, and interacts with the kundalini energy. It lights up and activates the pineal gland, causing it to become all-seeing or illuminated. Symbolically, this is the all-seeing eye in the back of the $1 bill, which is the symbol that the Illuminati use to represent their secret societies. So it's very precious that we protect our pineal glands, and removing our wisdom teeth uh, disconnects us from our pineal gland. Putting fluoride in the water, putting fluoride in our teeth. You know, they put mercury in your mouth. Well, mercury's not poisonous by itself, but you had bacteria, and you get methylmercury, and it is totally poisonous. What's in our mouth? Bacteria. Uh, be awake, be prepared, be alert, and be safe, folks. But just please do your homework before you allow any type of surgeries, any type of vaccine, you know, I can't say it, any type of all those things. Do your homework first. Thanks for listening. Appreciate all your support.